Hi guys, it's Melanie. Happy Saturday. So today I have another Swan Creek review to share with all of you. And today I'm going to be reviewing the Ginger Nectarine fragrance from Swan Creek. Now I'm reviewing it in their Herbal Melts format. And the Herbal Melts and the Drizzle Melts are the wax melts or wax tarts that you can purchase from Swan Creek. Now these are very large compared to other wax clamshells where you get you know six to eight smaller cubes. These are six very large cubes which are basically the equivalent of using two smaller wax cubes from basically any other wax melt company that uses a clamshell type format. So the herbs that you're seeing on top of the ginger nectarine here are basically just for decorative purposes. They, you can't smell them at all. There's no herbal scent infused into the wax. Um, so I, I think they're just put on there for like basically a decorative purpose. And a lot of the other ones that you see, the drizzle melts obviously have a drizzle over the top that looks like it could be chocolate or caramel or white chocolate. And, um, you know, some of them have like the little like sprinkles that you would put on like a cake or something. They're just basically for decorative purposes. They're, they, I don't, there's nothing that like should imply to you just because it looks like this has parsley on the top there's like a parsley note that's you know that's not it at all so these do retail for six dollars on the Swan Creek website which is where I am choosing to personally purchase all of my Swan Creek candles from I will link the website down below for you I'm choosing to purchase directly from the company because they do offer free shipping over $50 and they always include a free gift. And you can actually see the little tag there that says, thank you, free gift. So this was my free gift with my latest order. You haven't seen the haul yet of the newest candles that I purchased. You'll probably be seeing that on Monday, but this was one of the fragrances that I was on the fence about and I ended up not purchasing it. So the fact that they tossed it in as a freebie was fantastic because I was really curious about it but was kind of turned off by the name in terms of it potentially containing some ginger. I'm one of those people that doesn't really like ginger so that was what kept me from actually purchasing the candle format of this. But I'm happy to report it doesn't smell like ginger. I guess I'm happy for myself. <laughs> some people might be bummed out by that but for me, um, in terms of what this actually smells like, and I'll talk about the performance here in a little bit, but what this actually smells like is basically like a peach nectarine type mix. And um, the, the nectarine and peach scents for me are pretty interchangeable. They're not exactly the same, but I think most people, when they smell, smell peach and nectarine they're like oh yeah that's either peach or nectarine you know it's I think it would take a very refined nose to be like yes that's a nectarine and not a peach you know there's a subtle difference of this and that like basically when you're smelling this it smells like a fruity peachy nectarine like that's it <laughs> there's nothing else um it's just fruit and that fruit is peach and or nectarine so it's very refreshing for the summertime. It's not overpowering. I find this to be really pleasant and something that when you walk into a house, like when you're melting this particular fragrance, like you would just be like, that smells like summer. You know, like that's immediately what pop into your mind. Um, it smells basically like a summer fragrance fruit salad made of peaches and nectarines like it's really nice you guys um I was pleasantly surprised like I said no ginger I really don't pick that up at all it might be in there in like literally the slightest slightest way but not enough for me to like hone in on it which is good um if you are someone who does enjoy that ginger note I wouldn't really purchase this expecting to get a lot of that because I think you might be disappointed. But if you like really fresh peach type scents, um, 
it's not quite as tart as the market peach or harvest peach scent from Bath and Body Works, but it's along those same lines. It's it's smooth, it's just really pretty and summery. In terms of the performance, um these wax melts are great. I find that I get a solid three days of throw out of one of the cubes. By the end, middle end of the third day, I definitely start noticing it less, which, you know, for me, sometimes I've been changing it out every two days, but if I forget and let it go an extra day, and when I'm saying like days of like melting, I'm talking 24 hours a day. I typically don't turn my warmers off until I'm ready to change the wax out. So, um, so for 24 hours a day, typically two to three days in a row, this has been performing great. I would put the throw at about a solid seven and a half for an average sized room. Um, it doesn't throw terribly far. So I guess the strength is more of like a seven and a half. The throw is more of like a six, six and a half. You're not going to smell this like too terribly far away. I feel like the candles tend to throw further than the wax melts do, but I have warmers all throughout my house. So it's a little bit harder for me to be 100% sure about exactly how strong it is. But I would say probably if you are someone who wants like this throughout your entire house, I would place maybe a warmer or two in the upstairs of your house and a warmer or two in the downstairs of your house. That sounds excessive, but um, you know, at the very least one on each floor, you should be able to fill the vast majority of your house very nicely that way. Or if you just have like a ranch or a rambler type home where things are more spread out on one floor um one at either end of the house should probably do you but yeah you guys I'm, re I'm really glad that I tried this I don't know that I'll actually pick it up in candle format because there's so much more that I want to try from Swan Creek maybe next summer um but my next order I already have the candles for that chosen and I'm just waiting to um get a little bit further into May to actually place the order for those particular candles because I, I really don't need them right now. <laughs> so anyway, two thumbs up for the ginger nectarine fragrance. If you're looking for something fun and fruity for the summer, really think about giving this one a try. Um, like I said, these uh, drizzle and herbal melts retail for six dollars and it's quite a bit of wax that you're getting. It's uh, 4.75 ounces, so that's quite a bit. Um, again, I'll link the website down below. Let me know if you have any questions, guys, and I will see you in my next video. Take care, bye-bye.